Hi guys, I'm back trying to uh, explain Homer a little bit more in depth. Uh, the past two videos have been kind of explaining the website and uh, explaining uh, how to download and kind of the gen general uh, appearance of Homer. Uh, this video is going to be more about the conversion files. So if you go back to the Homer website, uh, homer-fnews.org, uh, you're going to go to the FAQ section. Now when you go to the FAQ section, you'll see the conversion files here. But first, uh, if you click on documentation, just to give you an idea of what the format actually looks like, if you scroll down to where it has the documentation on using Homer 2 UI, go to the Homer user's guide. Uh, that'll actually get you right here. On page four of the document, you'll see an SD variable. Uh, you'll actually see a handful of variables. You have a T, a D, uh, it goes a little bit more in depth as to what these explain, but T is the uh, data time points. Uh, D is the raw intensity time course. Uh, if you do want to view this document, again, it's just under documentation. Uh, the SD variable is very important. You're going to have uh, SD dot lambda dot source position, de uh, detector position, number of sources, number of detectors, and this mesh list variable, which is going to actually be the channels. So it, that's actually going to be the number of channels uh, as a row, the row dimension, and then four is the column dimension. The columns are uh, labeled here. So the first one's going to be the index of the source position, the index of the detector position. The third one is completely unused at the moment, so it's all just going to be ones. And then the fourth column here is going to be uh, the wavelength. So in our lab, we have two wavelengths. So basically you have a whole series of row data for the first wavelength, and then a duplicate of that for the second wavelength. If you have more wavelengths, obviously you'll have more. Uh, from there, if you go back to up here, the FAQ, here you'll actually find where the Nyrex to Nearest files are. So we use Nyrex. Uh, there's also one for Hitachi. Uh, the Hitachi uh, code was written by Rebecca Dewey at Nottingham, and the Nyrex was written by Rob Cooper at University 